King Charles delighted to engage with military families after Prince Harry's absence. Before we continue this video, please support this channel by like and subscribe. King Charles expressed his relief at being out of my cage as he engaged with military families during his first public military engagement since announcing his return to public duties, coincidentally just hours after Prince Harry's UK appearance. The 75-year-old king visited the Three Royal School of Military Engineering, 3RSME, the training base for the Army's Royal Engineers, where he assumed the role of Colonel-in-Chief last March, a position previously held by Queen Elizabeth II. Arriving at Gibraltar Barracks in Minlay, Wiltshire, King Charles received a red carpet treatment and a quarter guard salute before expressing his gratitude for the opportunity to visit. He humorously explained, Thank you so much. I do apologize for taking you by surprise. When this opportunity appeared and I was allowed out of my cage, I wanted to come and have a look. Lieutenant Colonel Robert Grant commented on the short notice for the visit, saying, we only had, if you take into account the bank holiday, only seven or eight days to pull it all together, but when you get that call asking if it's possible to arrange a visit for His Majesty, there is only one answer. During the engagement, King Charles conversed with trainees, trainers, and their families, sharing a light moment with heavily pregnant Sophie Mares, joking about her presence so close to her due date. Sophie, whose husband is in the engineers, remarked, I said I couldn't miss it. It's not every day the king comes to where your husband works. Outside, six-year-old Louis Bacon presented the king with a handmade drawing, while six-year-old Lucas Stewart offered honey made on the barracks. The king quipped, oh, just what I need. The timing of King Charles's engagement coincided with Prince Harry's solo appearance at St. Paul's Cathedral for a special service to celebrate 10 years of the Invictus Games. Despite hopes of a reunion, it was revealed that a meeting between father and son would not be possible due to the king's full schedule. A spokesperson for Prince Harry expressed understanding of the king's commitments and expressed hope for a meeting in the future, stating, the duke of course is understanding of his father's diary of commitments and various other priorities and hopes to see him soon.